Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to the stream. It's time to finally finish this game. Good end the game. Good end our beautiful boy, the Phasmid. We're talking to the Phasmid today. We're getting to touch and see and love our beautiful boy, the Phasmid, the bug, the most beautiful of them all. It's coming. It's today. I'm excited. Uh, I will say the game was a uh, it was kind of fucking up last time. <laughs> there was what you might call a bug in the game last time. And uh the the phasmid was not there. <laughs> it, the game was acting like the phasmid was there. The lines were all like, yeah, the phasmid's there. Like I was like, "Hey Kim, can you see the phasmid?" and Kim was like, "Yes, I can see the phasmid." And like it was not there. The phasmid was not there. <laughs> Reader, the phasmid was not there. So, um, we're gonna see how that works today. We're gonna try to, hopefully, uh, not die, you know? We're gonna try to find the bug. We're gonna try to have the game be a little more functional today. But it might take a little bit of clicking in and out of the game to have it be, uh, generally functional today. So we're gonna find how that works out. But hello, and welcome. Let's uh, pop into the game and see how broken it is. All right, my boy, are you here? No, oh, it is, it's here this time. All right, okay. <laughs> this is gonna be, this is gonna be an experience. This is gonna be an experience. We got a, we got a lot of checks. We got a lot of checks we're gonna have to pass in order to, to touch this bug. To touch the bug, so all right. We might have to do this a few times. Hello, Yuma. Hello, hello. We're uh, we're touching a bug today. We're hanging out with a bug. We're gonna see how well this works out because I probably am gonna have to save scum, and um, and uh, <laughs> it had a bug where the uh, save scumming was not working, where the bug the just disappeared. On long stilt-like legs, antennae hanging from his head like a woman's hair, white and curled at the tips. Beautiful. It is no more than five steps away from you. Yeah, the bug, the bug is all bugged. The bug, unfortunately, a little bit bugged. So we're gonna see, we're gonna, we're gonna try to make the bug successful. Reed-like tufts stick out of its joints, 
As the insect moves its forearms, it produces a faint hiss. Glorious. Like a reel-to-reel -reel machine spinning after the tape breaks. This is truly peak performance. Absolutely largest amount of sex appeal in the entire game. This is a beautiful, beautiful bug right here. Only creature in this game that I have any interest in. This beautiful, beautiful bug. The hiss is different from the strings you heard before. It says something else in a lower pitch. All right, listen carefully. Absolutely stunning. Say that again. I have absolutely. No <laughs> Wait, what idea. is that? <laughs> We're whispering to Kim. You hear the familiar ring of his jacket unzipping slowly, painstakingly slow. So. You glance over your shoulder. The lieutenant holds a piece of milled aluminium. He begins to pull it open extremely carefully. It's the camera. Gonna get shots of this bug? Gonna do bug photography? No. The flesh will scare the creature off. Warn him now. Are you sure you won't scare it off, Kim? We need a photo. No one will believe us. We be careful, Kim. From the corner of your eye, you see a sudden cascade of motion ripple through the insect's limbs. A series of ultrasonic clicks Stop. fills your ear. Stop. Let me approach it first. I won't be one of those fools who didn't take a picture. Okay, but let me touch the bug first. You see the insect turn to him. Its mandible antennae reaching out. Its motions are quick, sudden. Kim? Stop, Kim! Shh. Okay. Yeah, okay, okay. The spindly mechanism turns itself back to you. Its antennae taking their measure of the air, slowly. Say something to the insect, quietly, like, hey. The creature tilts its tiny head to the side Aww. and appears to look at you. It is incredibly light, like the slightest gust of wind should blow it away. Same. But it doesn't. <laughs> it's so cute. I love it. I love it. It's so adorable. I love. I also just turn my head to the side when I'm confused. It's like, what's that? <laughs> I think animals actually do that because it helps them like hear better because it like positions your ears um, at an angle, and so it helps give them more like vertical hearing. Does not help me in any way, <laughs> but it's still fun. Don't be afraid, buddy. Nothing changes in the cyclical brain motion of the creature's limbs. They are porcelain white on the inside and reed colored on the out. Beige, light brown, and striped. You are unsure if it is scared or not. It's my body. Its insect mind is impenetrable to your <laughs> reasoning. All right. You exist, my beautiful boy. A sudden chirrup fills the air. The walking stick moves its whole body, limbs working independently of each other, like the parts of a masterfully constructed machine. It's so beautiful. Something in its body language has changed just slightly. All right, electrochemistry. <laughs> Electrochemistry. Three? I think that's what I was trying last time. Three points? Is that enough? Ooh, still an eight. We got more points. Let's try. We can just max. I think we can just max electrochemistry. All right, let's go. This is the best we can do. 42%. 42%! No! <laughs> Sango, we're just we're listening, we're Indeed, lurking, talking to the bug. Step. The invertebrate reacts with uncanny speed, Please. skating away across the water. It's gone like a skipping stone, leaving nothing but rings on the sea's calm mirror. Feel free to lurk, Sango. We're gonna be um doing a lot of saves coming to try to talk to the bug. Hello, Electrip. Hello, welcome. We're the, the we we did not succeed. We failed. We failed at talking to the bug. Oh my gosh, we got an 18 though. That was pretty close. We're gonna have to work real hard on this bug. Where? Where did it go? Yeah. You never had a chance. There was something off the moment you approached it. It was scared of you. Of humans. No. Your voice echoes on the water. 
All right. But yeah, this is totally doable. We just gotta... We just gotta make this work. All right, we're loading my save. We're loading my save. Please still be here, bug. Yeah, 42% totally doable. It's, it could totally work out. It's still here. It's here this time. It was not here last time when I tried to reload the game. Wait, wait, I should check my clothes. Make sure that I have the maximum electrochemistry. Yeah, I've got plus three. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure this is the best I can do. Oh, wait, these pants. Oh, these, the other pants also give me electrochemistry. But yeah, I think we are just going to have to do the whole just dump everything into electrochemistry. I think I set up the clothes well before because I would, like thought that electrochemistry was the one we'd have to get. So I think it's set up. But I may as well check. Doesn't hurt to be fully prepared. All right, yeah, this is the best we got. All right, bug. It's time. The creatures. All right, we've seen this all before. From I have a you glance. No, Her. the flesh will scare the. We need a foot from the corner of your. I won't be. You see the insect turn to him. It's mandible. Just listen to me. The spindly mechanism turns itself back to you. Its antennae taking their measure of the air, slowly. But yeah, I'm not gonna, like, click through all- Like, I'm gonna click through all of these, but I'm not gonna, like, listen to all of it. Because we're probably gonna have to do this, like, a lot. <laughs> we're probably gonna have to go through all of these things, like, many, many times. So I'm not gonna, like, listen to all of them today. The creature tilts its tiny- Alright. Nothing changed. It's insect mud. A sudden ch Something in its body- Alright, electrochemistry! Changed. Just like- Max it out! Let's go, 42%? No! <laughs> this is like at least the third time I failed this 42%. You bi because I failed it last time. <laughs> Please, I know. <laughs> it's, a, it's like we should theoretically get it one every two times, you know? The creature Ish. stands. Read like the hiss is different from the strings you heard before. <laughs> ch 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 I have a you glance. No, we need a photo from the corner of. I won't be. You see the in Shh. the spindly mechanism. The creature tilts. Nothing. Ch it's insect mind. A sudden ch something in its body language has changed, just slightly. Yeah, as far as I can tell, I have incredible luck when it doesn't matter at all and really horrendous luck if it matters in any way. Like, gotcha? Gotcha's great. It doesn't matter at all. My luck is incredible. And <laughs> something that I actually care about, like I have like reverse streamer luck where like off stream, my luck's really good. On stream, my luck is terrible. So, uh, <laughs> we just gotta, we just gotta roll the electrochemistry gotcha over and over again today, guys. I think there's gonna be another check after this as well, but I don't remember what it is. So, uh, <laughs> we're gonna see what happens. Gotcha luck, except mine is good. I roll great on gotcha. I just, this is, uh, this is not the gotcha for me. <laughs> this is not the gotcha that I went at. But okay, 42%. Let's go, let's go. No, see? See? <laughs> this is like the fourth time in a row. What did we get? get? Step. We got yeah. an 18 again. An 18 again? <laughs> I... <laughs> I mean, I have bad luck because I've got gotcha luck. That's fair. It's a... Yeah, I live in the upside down world. At least we're not having the bug bug again. The bug is still here. The creature stands on read like the hiss is different. Ch -ch I have you glance. No, the f we need a f from the corner. I want you see the Shh. the spindly mech. The creature tilts. Nothing. Ch it's insect. A sudden chirrup. Something in its body language has changed just slightly. All right, we got this. We got this. Forty-two percent. Forty-two. Please. No! This is the fifth time! This is the fifth time! Oh 
Why is it like you this? Really get to take one step. Wait, the what? Ray reacts with uncanny speed, skating away. Inevitably fails. It's gone, like a skipping stone, leaving nothing but rings on the sea's calm mirror. Wait. I got it. I hit. I got a twenty. Is it? Is it not me to beat it? Can I just not do this one? Is this impossible? Is it like literally impossible? I haven't been checking the totals. Yeah, wait, what? Okay, we can get like a 21 at least at some point. And if the 21 fails, then we truly just fail. I'm, I'm so confused, though. I mean, that would explain why we failed five times in a row. I just... This sounds wrong, you know? Like, it says 42%. It says I have a chance. So I feel like I should have a chance. The creatures that read like the hiss is different. I have You glow. No. The flesh will scare the creature off. Whis maybe we whisper? the corner of your eye. You see us. I won't be one. You see the understood. The spindly I'm mechanism. so confused. The creature till I'm nothing so changed. It's insect. My bug, my boy, I love Something you. Something in its body language has changed. Please, my boy, Just I love like... you. Alright. Please. Alright. What do we roll? You barely get to take one step. Nope. <laughs> just rolled too low. We just rolled too low. This is the sixth time in a row at a 42% chance. <laughs> Please, bug. Please. The creature stand. Read like the hiss is different from. I have. You glow. No. We need a. From the corner of your eye. I won't be. You see the insect. Understood. The spindly mechanism. The creature. Please. Nothing. It's insect. Please, but something in its body language has changed. Electrochemistry. Like... Okay, please. No, <laughs> number seven. Please, bug. You barely get to take one step. The yeah, no. With uncanny speed. We rolled Skating too low. Ooh, does gone. booze make us better at electrochemistry? That's a good idea. Let's try that. One sec. Alright, alright. Tools. Physique. It's just physique. Oh, wait, physique. Oh, wait, physique is the whole. Yeah, that's the whole thing. Oh, so it does make us better. All right, it's time. How do I actually drink the beer? Where is the button for drink the beer? How do I, how do I drink the beer? Do I switch hand? Isn't there a button for drink the beer? Wait. It's time! It's time for electrochemistry! How do I drink the- is it- Where is button for drink beer? Please, I need button for drink beer. Use is left too? Interact? It's not interact? Button for drink beer? Where are you? Yeah? Yeah? Is it not this? Okay, okay. Internet? Internet. Help me. Help me with the drink beer. Disco. Elysium. How to drink beer. Please, how do I consume? Yes, I want spoilers. Or whatever this is. Put them in my hand and then click on the icon on the bottom right. The icon on the bottom right. 
the unclickable icon in the bottom right. Bottom right. Is it? I tried changing hands and it didn't help. I just can't. It's also a bug. <laughs> Point the cursor slightly below the item box. Oh! Oh, ho, ho, ho. no, we can do it. We can do it. It's just that my cursor has to be right here. Right? Do we do it? Please? Please? No? Huh? Ha. I don't click the button. Has... Okay, wait. But it's not doing it. It's not doing it. All right, we might just have to we might just have to live with what we got. Like this should be the button. But it's unclickable. Is is it is a uh... Yep. Is a uh, it's unclickable. <laughs> this is just life. We can't we can't drink. Not allowed to drink. The creature stand read like the hiss is dead. I have you glow. No, the flash was. We need it from the corner of your eye. I won't be. You see, understood. The spindly mechanism turns <laughs> itself back to you. We it's drank. Antennae taking their measure of the air. We drank slowly. once, like we drank once before. So it's wait. I can do it here. Oh, okay. We'll go through this first. The creature tilts its. Yeah, it's there the now. It's insect. A sudden cheer up. Something in its body language. It was it was straight up just, just a bug. Something. It also has a different like icon. Like it was just the hand before. Like before it thought our hand was empty and so it wouldn't let us click because it thought it was uninteractable. But now it's actually the bottle. We may as well fully boost our electrochemistry as well anyway. Why am I able to boost my electrochemistry so much? Wait. Oh, okay, okay. That this click area is still real tiny. <laughs> Alright, we did it. We did it. 58, come on, we can do it. What the fuck? Okay, well, what did we roll? What did we roll on this 58? Is this number number eight that we failed? You barely get to take one step. The invertebrate no. reacts with uncanny speed, skating away across the water. It's gone, like a skipping stone. Is it just impossible? On the sea's calm mirror. We actually just can't? We rolled, we rolled high enough. We rolled high enough, we actually just can't do it. I'm... I'm so confused. Is this, or is this how the game is supposed to be? Can't you... Can't you? Yeah, maybe dialogue options? I, but like, which ones? Like, it said inevitably failed. All right. Completing the side quest. Oh, no! <laughs> Do you have, okay, wait. Didn't level that skill. Wait. Where? You never had a chance. Okay. There was something off so there's the two trip. options. There's two options. One is that we needed to do a side quest earlier in the game, and so we can't do that now. Because of this we didn't do a side quest earlier in the game. Um, huh, so the options are either that I have the thought that makes me fail all red checks, which I think I don't. Yeah, we didn't take that one. We don't have the fail all red checks. That would have been, that would have been... This one. That would have been the precarious world. 
and we did not take the precarious world. So the only situation is that there was like a side quest earlier in the game that we didn't do. That means that we don't get the phasmid. I think, I think that might be what happened. Covered in, oh, okay, so, so you're supposed to take the pheromones. Like, there's a time when you're talking to the guys, the phasmin people, at the beginning, and if you get the pheromones sprayed on you, you pass. And if you don't get the pheromones sprayed on you, you fail. And that's just, that's just it. But the problem is that I sent, I sent, I sent the people away a long time ago. They were sick and old and I felt bad for them and I didn't want them to stick around and hang out. So I sent them away like a long time ago in gameplay. So at this point, there's, there's nothing to do. It was, it wasn't on day, so it has to be after day three, because you can't even meet the guy until day three. So I, but I, I actually, yeah, you can't even meet them until day three. So, but I think I sent them away, like, early on day four or something like that. And we're, like, day six right now, I think. So it's like, it's really far away. It would be really hard to like, go back. Like I, I did their quest first. <laughs> oh, it's fine to hack my save. Is that possible? Is that a thing that I can do? I was going to, I was going to like, grab a YouTube video. <laughs> I was gonna like be like it's not gonna work out we can't do it I'm just gonna find a YouTube video of someone doing it and we can watch the YouTube video together <laughs> because I yeah I think hacking the save would be harder than harder than anything else and also maybe not the correct idea on a twitch stream <laughs> I'm not sure how okay a lot of that is like, I know you're, like, not supposed to use emulators and stuff, and so I feel like hacking the game might be a bad idea. Alright. But. What we can do is we can try to get Kim to take a picture. Maybe we can do Coach's that successfully. Dance. Read like the hiss is different from the strings you heard. I have abs- You glow. No. The f we need a foot from the corner of your All right, eye. we're just going to let Kim you take the picture. With the sound of metal sliding against metal, the lieutenant reveals the lens. The glass glints in his hand as he begins to slide in an ampoule. You see the insect turn to him, its mandible antennae reaching out. Its motions are quick, sudden. The ampoule will produce a loud hiss. You're right. It could scare it away. I need a better moment when it's not looking. Yeah. I'll wait. I'm on standby, he thinks. His hands sweaty around the machine. Kim, just take the picture. The spindly mechanism turns itself <laughs> back to you. It's antennae taking their measure. Kim, the it's air. not gonna get better. The creature tilts its... Kim, just take the Nothing picture. Changed. It's not it's getting insane. any better. A sudden ch Something in its body has <laughs> changed. Just slightly. <laughs> Precious boy. You barely get to take one step. The invertebrate reacts with uncanny speed, skating away across the water. It's gone, like a skipping stone, leaving nothing but rings on the sea's calm mirror. Where? Where did it go? You never had a chance. There was something off the moment you approached it. Oh, it was scared of <laughs> there we have. I should have taken the pheromone from Morel. Ugh. Well, okay, we can click through all of our sad, angry dialogue options, our angsty dialogue options, and our poor boy being gone. And then we can watch a video. I think the rest of the ending is going to be the same because the only change has been that we have our gun. Like, I thought that having the gun would maybe make the other ending better, but it didn't. <laughs> Everyone's dead still.
So the only changes we have are guns. So I think the rest of the ending is fine. So I think we go through our sad options and we can watch a YouTube video. And this is going to be a lot shorter than I thought it was going to be. But that's okay. But yo, yeah, oh no, my precious boy. Your voice echoes on the water. I should have taken the pheromone from Morel. I don't think, I don't think it had anything to do with the ox spray. It was just. It had everything to do with the ox spray, Kim. It literally had everything to do with the ox spray. <laughs> it really did, Kim. Kim is just trying to be nice to us, but he's wrong. Kim. There is uncertainty in his phrasing. It did have something to do with the ox spray, Kim. Okay, but I'm not an entomologist, okay? Neither was the parascientist. Who knows? The only thing I'm sure of is we saw it. It was real. It was real. It was real. Okay, what in God's name was that? A stick insect of some sort, pretending to be the reeds. Has it been there the whole time? It's been there the whole time. Someone must have known about it, though. Maybe there's some secret to approaching it? I have no idea. I've never heard of a species It's like the that. pheromone, Kim. <laughs> it was the pheromone. They were right the whole time. I should have listened. I was... Too proud am uh, I hubris has been the end of me. And I thought I could interact with the phasmid without having the precious the precious pheromone. Tragic. Alright, where to go? No. It's gone for now, Lieutenant Yefrita. <laughs> How did it do that? Glide? It appears the insect can walk on water, like a water strider, you know? It's almost as fast. Uncanny. Tell me you got the picture. He shakes his head in silence, an expression on his face that you've never seen there before. Just swallow our sadness. It's just a blur. What now? What now? <laughs> I forgot about this guy. <laughs> just watching us have our whole time cop moment over here. <laughs> and he's just like, what the fuck are you on about? Our suspect's not looking so good. We should check him over. Also, it looks like it has some kind of nest there. Maybe there's proof in there. In the reeds, where the phasmid was hiding, you see a little flash of white. Porcelain white. Yeah, alright. We tried. We tried to see our precious boy, but there's nothing we can do about it. Alright. And then the rest of the ending is everything we've seen before. Like, I think they've got Clausia's stuff in here. We take the guy back home. And then our other police officers are over there. And they're like, Harry, you fuck. You've been, you been on the island doing your fucking shit the whole time. And you're like, yeah, man, I'm a fucked up cop. And then they're like, ah, that's our buddy. <laughs> and you go home with them. And that's the end of the game. So, <laughs> let's watch a YouTube video. I'm just going to exit the game. Because uh, otherwise it's going to be sound in the background. And there's no point in having it be sound in the background. It takes a long time to exit for some reason. All right. Um. Okay. Let me... Open up a Chrome window. A nice Chrome window. We're on, I usually use my personal account. And so this Chrome, this, uh, this YouTube's a little, like, don't think anything of my recommendations on this YouTube account because they're entirely, they're mostly not based on anything. They're mostly just what YouTube thinks regular people want to watch. <laughs> because it doesn't have very much information about this account. So, okay. We're looking for Disco Elysium Phasmid. All right. Insulidian Phasmid Reveal Voiced. 20 minutes. Oh, that's loud. All right. Was that really loud for you guys? Because that was, like, really loud for me. 
Is that a, that's a, that's more reasonable, right? <laughs> it was a bit loud. It was really loud for me. I think the game is louder for me than it is for you guys so that you can hear me over the game. Yo, oh boy, it was loud. All right, let me make sure that everything on this page is like a reasonable thing to show. Yes, okay. How do I, we're gonna add a source. Do I add a, is it a browser source? That probably doesn't make sense. Where'd it go? Okay, we're gonna, I think I just share the screen. Is that what I do? Window capture, that sounds about right. Window capture. Browser. Okay. Yeah. There it is. We're just gonna make it smaller. And nothing scary is showing and move it down. Down, down, down. I have so many sources. <laughs> I, cause every time I've ever put something onto here, I just like leave it and never clean up my sources. So I have a lot of them. I guess we can actually just make it pretty big. <laughs> or we can like make it larger in the YouTube. It's like not the right size. That's kind of annoying. Why is it a bad size? Anyway. All right. That's good enough. Uh, theater mode. Look at that. It's all big now. All right. Let's uh, watch this lovely person's video. The creature stands on long stilt-like legs, <laughs> antennae hanging from his head like a woman's hair white and curled at the tips. It is no more than five steps away from you. The segmented antenna <laughs> move with apprehension, searching for something that's not there. Yeah, I was looking at the Reed drip like too. It's, stick out of its, joints. it's great, I like the As drip. As the insect moves its forearms, it produces a faint hiss, like a reel-to-reel -reel machine spinning after the tape breaks. Yeah, the drip is like, he's the wearing the same hat we were hearing. strings you heard before. It's an electrochemistry it hat, I guess. <laughs> in a lower pitch. The music is so good. Be afraid. You smell wrong. <laughs> it is. You glance over your shoulder. <laughs> yeah, popcorn the time. It's weird to me no. the to just watch this. Off. Warn him now. We need a photo. No one will believe us. You know, like I'm not used to just watching stuff. You see a sudden cascade of motion ripple through the phasmid's limbs. A series of ultrasonic clicks fills your ear. I am not palatable. Do not eat me. <laughs> Wait, the has person has so many things talking to them that we don't have. I be one of those fools who didn't take a picture. You can bring Kudo here instead of Kim. That's horrendous. It's mandible and That's terrible. <laughs> Its motions are quick <laughs> and incredible. Sad. Understood, of course. The spindly mechanism turns itself back to you. Its antennae taking their measure. I feel like Kim would be a an active danger the to the bug. The walking stick moves its whole body, limbs working independently of each other, like the parts of a masterfully constructed machine. It moves just an inch closer to you, or does it only? Feel this like guy has such crazy stats. Everything is talking to him. Just like oh my god. 97. That was so Slowly, many things. With your breath held, you take two small steps toward the phasmid. The creature lets out a series of ultrasonic clicks that swarm around your head like swarms. Oh, that's beautiful. Like laughter. A sort of happiness. Sweat drips from your brow. Soak in your chest. <laughs> You reek of it. Your chemical. It is happiness. I love it. The on the creature's abdomen expands in front of you to take in and expel air. It's smelling you. Hissing and clicking, it extends its mandible-like antennae to greet you. 
You're right below it now, looking up at the colossal chitin of its white limbs. The head of the creature is crowned by reeds, and its eyes are like small droplets Aww, of water. So pure, it's so pretty. Maybe it is real. The pheromone. The pheromone. <laughs> now, now, he is ready it to really be was. The insect's head is crowned with reed-like scales, the shape of seed heads. They rustle as the air moves. The ventricles at its abdomen continue to expanding like lunglets. What are lunglets? Breathing you in. Your sour, greasy, <laughs> semiochemicals on the breeze. The insect stops its stridulation, seeming to observe you. Below its crown of reeds, little pinprick eyes detect motion, glittering. The world stands still around you. <laughs> Such a beautiful Suddenly, moment. There is silence. I wish we had the beautiful no, moment. Stop. Be afraid. Put your hand down. The invertebrate comes down. back to life, stridulating. Sets of complex eyes follow you, moving in tandem on either side of the insect's small head. No reply. He says hello. A total ancient silence comes from its mouth, along with what appears to be some kind of foam. The stridulations of its limbs continue all around you. You were right. Little bubbles form on the mouth parts of the creature on its segmented lower lip. Hmm? It looks to be foaming. Foaming? Slowly. The foam is white. What? Yellowish. The faintest smell like you've never felt before. What? Like burnt roses. It's foamy. Careful. It may be poisonous. Ooh, yeah. The foam slowly turns a darker shade like burnt caramel as the insect moves its mouth parts, masticating. Nom, nom, nom. The little bubbles begin to burst, one by one, letting out that same smell like summer burning. Apricot blossoms, white blossoms erupting, a sensation <laughs> like cold air. And Linda Empire's like, think about your wife right now. Attempt to think about your wife. Tell me what you're doing, Inland Empire. <gasps> oh, it does exist. I exist too. Tell me what is life for you? Um, it's Wonderbar. Yes, holy is the Lord of hosts. And all the earth is filled with his glory. Now, I will tell you what it's like for me. For me, it is a series of half lit images. A kind of darkness being intruded upon. Transient, dim, moist. Intruded upon by what? Shapes of plants and animals. And internal sensations. A swarm of sounds, tiny vibrations on the inside of my forearms, all speak of complexities totally beyond my understanding. It's so beautiful. The voice acting is I so am good. I at the end of an era funnel, weightless, so light, it only feels like something to be me. In truth, perhaps I'm nothing. I certainly do not have a soul, and if I did. It will never ache. I'm glad to be me, an you incredibly sensitive instrument. Imagine the horror of you. It's all of creation reflected in your foreplay. <laughs> it must be like the highest of hells, a kaleidoscope of fire and writing glass. <laughs> Eternal damnation. It's pretty damnation. Even when you're sleeping, and when you wake, you carry it around on your neck. With eyes open that cannot help but swallow more behind the mirror. I feel great, mute, empathy for you. It's hell. I changed my mind. I want to be you. Or It was very disorienting at first, but I'm keeping my shit together. That must be incredibly hard. The arthropods are in silent and meaningless all of you. Know that we're watching. When you're tired... When the vision spins out of control, the insects will be looking on. Oh, I'm rooting for the insects too. And when you fall, we will come to raise you up. But from you, banner like, blossom from you and carry you apart in the sky funeral. In honor of your passing, 
but not me, because I'm just a leaf eater. Yeah, insects. In honor Best of your boy. will, Lieutenant Ifreta, that you kept from falling apart in the face of sheer terror, day after day, second by second. Detective. Detective. <laughs> on the scene. Oh, I am a detective. Oh my gosh, this person has so much morale. I was born to detect sucrose rewards and semiochemicals. What were you born to detect? <laughs> also that. I was born to detect yes. you. Of no course. one detected me for such a long, long time. For thousands of years. I did it. Out of sight. Trapped myself in greenery. This is my masterpiece. No one believed I exist. Almost no one, until you came, detective, dripping of blood that smells like strawberries across the calm sea, the first in a thousand nights. Is this a dream? No. What's happening? You are awake. I am real. Light is forming me. This is real. I love how real it is. It's my boy. Not even the birds know that. Not even the water you eat. We need to know. Perhaps it's sent to us by a god. I think we should eat it. Please <laughs> eat and put it in your mouth. Or read. Yum yum. Yum yum. <laughs> I am an all known species of the order Phantasmodia, endemic to the Insolentia Isola. I love it so much. For the last 350 years, I have hidden in plain sight, masquerading as the reeds, molting. Cooling myself, unfolding at night to play with treasures and boys. <laughs> it may have unknown, dangerous biochemical characteristics that help it maintain its camouflage. It's so cute. No, no one believed they exist. Almost no one. Until you came, detective, dripping off blood that smells like strawberries across the mm -hmm. calm sea. The first in a thousand years. Hmm? That is not what is written on the I text. I have stayed through four forms of government and two scientific revolutions until I was accidentally discovered by a detective of the city's <laughs> militia in Revolution, district of Martinez. Not an accident. 51. Highly planned. Yes. I do not have a star to display. So I use a newer degenerative element to aid in camouflage. Do not worry. It is only destructive over long periods of time. <laughs> the deserter. Mm. He's been here for a long time. Yeah, they had a theory last time. Like, even in my timeline, they no. had the theory. You are the miracle. Oh. It was you coming from the west. From the whirling. You were coming. The moral of our encounter is... I am a relatively medium life form, while you are extreme, all engulfing man. Mm -hmm. A volatile senior nervous system, ominously new <laughs> to the planet. The pale too came with you. Oh, jeez. No one remembers it before you. The Nidarians do not. The radial asymmetrics do not. <laughs> there is an almost unanimous agreement between the birds and the plants. That you are going to destroy us all. Wait, is the pale is human made? It's a shadow cast into the world by you, eating away at reality. A great, unnatural territory. Its advent coincides with the arrival of the human mind. Huh. But yeah, my man, his brain was uh, brain having a bad time. The vacuum of cosmos and the stars burning in it are afraid of you. Give me enough time, you will wipe us all out and replace us with nothing. Just by accident. How? We suspect it will be something like the oxygen holocaust that wiped out anaerobic life 2.6 billion Oof. years ago when organisms first started breathing. Only much worse. Instead of air, you exhale thoughts. There are no trees that eat thoughts. And that's what the pale's made of? Everything your eyes touch goes back there. Behind the nose mirror. What if you blink? Are we still here? Please don't blink. What if you misplace us all one day? Or just forget? 
Have I always no. thought this way? You're only thinking it now. This is a revelation. But I want to blink and undo 12 billion years. <laughs> Alright, what are they gonna pick? I'll be extra careful not to blink, stick and say, don't worry. Oh. Or one day, one of you will close your eyes and sign and open them to see that none of this ever existed. It's so beautiful. It doesn't look like that, no. And what does it look like, we're Kim? Just at it. We're, we're chatting. We're meeting our best friend. Okay. Is it somehow related to the cave? <laughs> It's about our fate, Kim. <laughs> Kim, I have totally transcended the case. I think we should take the picture, and then you should back away from the unstudied species. We have to say goodbye now. <laughs> it doesn't look like you're just staring at it. Okay, one more conversation. Okay. I think we should take the picture. <laughs> oh, he says the same thing. Should back away from the unstudied Sad. species. No. It was he. Alright, exploring more options. Instead of there, you... Everything your eyes touch goes back there. I don't know, Mira. What if you blink? Please be. Or one? No. There is one We have to say goodbye now. Of all the creatures I've met, you're the kindest. The most beautiful. Please pick most beautiful. No, I picked kindest. I also have one more thing to say to you. That woman. Turn from the ruin. Turn and go forward. Do it for the woman. <laughs> Hell yeah, baby. Forget about it your dead okay. wife. It doesn't take Do it for the working class. To tell you that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> there is no change in the insect's motion while it's being aimed by the camera. It remains fixated on you. In three. <laughs> if it moves, you jump back. I'll shoot. Here we go. Three, two, one. Take the picture. The shrill flash of the camera cuts the air like the blade of a sword. The phasmid freezes in its bright light. Head turned toward the lieutenant, hypnotized by the flash. It's so it pretty. Frozen before I you. love it so the much. The sweat on your arms feels cold as ice. It's beautiful. As if you're frozen as well. In the shadow of this great statue of chitinous marble. I got it. Oh. He's hello, yellow. Hello, hello. Yeah, I should switch so to dark mode, you too. <laughs> Touch its whisker. Carefully pet its scythe like form. The okay, touch the whisper. From a great height. Whisker. With your hand shaking, you barely touch the tip of the left whisker. On contact. The kiting curls into a spiral, like the tip of a poison ivy. Its touch on your fingertip feels cold. Ticklish. It's so pretty. It is surprisingly delicate. The curly end of the whisker, like a young vine. It's even a bit wet. <laughs> Be careful, detective. It's moving. <gasps> Wait, look at our finger. You were right. Ooh. It glistens with some kind of moisture. The creature in front of you. Like the finger. Like the finger. It tastes like. Sugar, <laughs> very faint. The anthropod towers above you, tufts of reeds pointed from limb and head alike, odorless, mostly comprised of water. Wait, pet it, pet it, pet it. The limb before you is incredibly light, like eggshell. It's much lighter than a reed. You feel a soft push could tip the creature over. Its hollow exoskeleton collapsing. A small shadow passes the creature's arm. High above you, its black pearl eyes still glisten, mesmerized by the light passing its nervous system. <sighs> there is some kind of countdown happening as it slowly processes <laughs> the overwhelming brightness of the signal. The invertebrate is regaining control. The stimulus overloaded it. It's passing like an extended moment or a gallstone. We got Another it. Another shudder passes Our through boy. the creature's limbs. It jolts back to life, like a record continuing where it left off, in a swaying, praying motion. Even the small black pearls of its eyes do not stray from you. Alright, disengage slowly. Away, the phasmid mirrors your movements, stepping on the water. 
the long limbs carrying its feather weight without breaking its surface. Ah, oh, that was so beautiful. I love it so much. I'm so sad we couldn't get this on our actual and one. Just like that. In our actual it's gone. game. Skating away across the sea's calm mirror like a skipping stone, leaving nothing but circles on the water and something under it. In the place it stood, bobbing there among the reeds, mm -hmm. a collection of items. It's gone. All right. We've seen the collection of items. Yeah, it's almost done. We got 30 seconds. Yes, like a water strider. Only I've never seen anything like that in my life. Looks like a nest of some sort. We should have looked. What now? <laughs> in some kind of strange, semi-catatonic state. Our suspect is not looking so good. We need to check on him. All right. That was beautiful. All right, cancel. Don't play. It was so pretty. I'm sad that we couldn't see that in our actual game, that it didn't work out, but it was so beautiful. The phasmid is so cute. I'm gonna... Can I grab me? Oh gosh. 